where law ends, tyranny begins. Some things bear repeating, and even when they don't always sink in. God's word to Israel and the first two commandments could hardly have been clearer. No other gods, no idols. Yet, he would later repeat those same warnings again and again to impress or exclusive devotion to the God of Israel. God knew full well the principle that you eventually worship what you serve. Therefore, whatever or whoever commands your attention becomes your God. Recognizing that fact can help you guard against idolatry. Here are two questions that may point to the real Lord of your life. Number one, what do you think about when your mind is in neutral? Number two, what do you do during your idle moments? Review your own loyalties and then fill in the blank. An objective observer of my life over the past week would conclude that blank is my God. Is there something that needs to change in your life?